Hey guys, how you doing? How you hanging? It's been a while. I know, I know. Don't kill me. I know, guys. So in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys how I get rid of my dry freaking ass hair. So if you're interested, stay tuned. So the product that we're going to be using today is aloe vera. So um, I've been like eyeballing aloe vera and trying to figure out how I'm going to implement it into my hair, even though I want to use it for the longest, the longest time. But I just couldn't find it in one of the shops here. So when I went to this particular one, it was an Asian shop and I found it. I was so, so, so happy. Like the happiness level, it was through the roof. So we're just going to um, get started and I'm going to share with you guys a story of how I came to um, find it. Because a friend of mine was using it. Uh, she lives in Antwerp. There's one city here in Belgium. And I was always on her case, like, get it for me. But from Antwerp to where I live, Ghent, it is like a whole other distance. Like, it is an hour drive, and I didn't need it that bad. So I was like, okay, we can skip it for a while. But then I found it in my city. Shout out to Ghent in my city. So... I'm going to stop the blabbing and we're just going to get into it. So I've already cut them into these chunks. I'm going to cut them again for them to be smaller and it is easier to use. So first of all, you're going to cut off the sides because it is very sharp and it can cut you as well. So once we've done that, then I'm going to cut them into two again. So this is the size that I'm going to use for my hair. And it is actually a normal size. It looks bigger on camera, but it is actually a normal size. So I'm going to do it with the other ones as well. I had four of the chunks that I just showed you guys. I used the other ones. It was like big leaves. So I used... Um, some of it on my daughter's hair yesterday and gave some to my niece so you can imagine how big how big it was don't mind my voice i'm just under the weather so yeah and we're still recording <laughs> so yeah we're done and afterwards you're going to cut them right in the middle and that is when you get your gel part as you can see it is really sticky voila <laughs> i'm like a child again i'm playing with it so when you're finished with this you're going to poke like some holes into them i'm going to do it like this so that you guys can see what i'm doing you poke some holes in it and like two holes is actually um, enough if you poke too much the um, how do you call this I don't even know the name of it but we're going to call it the food it will start coming off and you get all of it in your hair so you just poke two um, holes in them and then we're going to start sectioning up the hair I have my clip here yeah the clip is here we're going to start sectioning it and then start applying it to the hair so aloe vera is like a, a really 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 good plan for your hair look i've put it here and i'm looking for it um it has so many benefits so aloe vera has um proteolytic um enzymes in them that is um how do you say it? that causes your hair to repair itself so it has um it repairs um dead skin cells 
I'm just trying to because that word just take everything that I wanted to say out of my mouth. You have to drink water before you can pronounce that word. That um proteolytic enzymes. Like I was like, how am I going to pronounce this thing? But we got it done. So it repairs um dead skin cells. It um serves as a conditioner as well for your hair, which leaves the hair really really soft shiny and um how do you say it i'm even lost like what I, what i wanted to say i'm even lost and it um if you are suffering from dandruff it helps with that as well so if you have dandruff problem don't go buying um them shampoos just use like natural products and you've gotten rid of it so um what i wanted to tell you guys was like i was looking for this aloe vera like for ages and couldn't find them i was like going to all these asian shops going to as you have aloe vera and they will be like no we don't so <clears throat> i asked my cousin who you guys know already virginia i asked her to bring me the aloe vera because she lives in the netherlands and you know Netherlands um, compared to Belgium, Belgium is like a womb. <laughs> Belgium is like a village compared to the Netherlands. So I asked her, I was like, can you bring me? And she was like, yeah, um, I haven't seen it here, the, the leaf, but I can get the plant for you. So I was like, yeah, okay. If um, you don't have it there, just bring me the plant. So this girl went and bought the plant. Yes, girl, I'm putting your business out there of how you did me when I was in need. <laughs> like, she's really good. Just this one, she didn't come through. But for most part, she always come through, like most of my family are. And um, so she came here and... I asked her, I was like, girl, where's the plan? And she was like, shoot, I forgot the plan. So I was so pissed. I was like, I was waiting to do a video with it and you just forgot about it. So we went to this Asian shop just to get um, malt. It is like a drink known to Africans, not only Ghanaians, but I think Africans in general. We went there to get the malt. So once we were there, she saw like we saw the plant but the plant was not attractive it was like on the dead side like it looked a bit dead and she was like oh let's just get the plant and then you can cut them up and um use it on your hair and i was like no i wasn't feeling it so we just turned and she was like girl what are you talking about they have it here and i'm like no because i've been to this shop like a million times and I've never seen the aloe vera leaf here so she just <laughs> grabbed my hair she just turned it and I was so ecstatic like I was so happy even the guy at the corner was looking like why are you guys so happy and then I was like if you know how long I've been looking for this and since I said that every time I go to the show he'll be like I have aloe vera here and I'm like yeah I know I just came I came for it <laughs> so like that was like a little bit of a story of how we came about and how we found out that they do sell aloe vera here in Ghent as well so that was a bit of the story so I'm so happy that now I can just go <clears throat> to the it's not actually like a supermarket but it's like uh, um how do you guys call it like um um corner shop yeah like a corner shop so i'm so happy that i don't have to travel all those miles just to go and get aloe vera so we're still on it we're still poking and as you can see, like it leaves like a shine on your hair and the food is not getting in my hair. If it, even if it gets in there, it will not be 
as much because I didn't poke so much um, holes in them. And make sure you do it gently because otherwise the aloe vera as you can see it is not much but just be gentle with it because i was talking i was all over the place be gentle with it and it will not be pulling your hair So aloe vera can be used on dry hair as well, but I prefer my hair to be wet um, so that it doesn't take long for it to soak in the hair or for it to penetrate in the hair. It is easier when the hair is um, wet. It penetrates easier because when the hair is dry, it has to soak in it first before it can really give you um the wet effect so i like doing it this way but if you're somebody who likes doing it on dry hair that is also possible you don't have to do it um only when your hair is is wet so as you can see i have one in my hair but that's no picky biggie 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 can't you see <laughs> And also one thing I forgot to mention is if you have burns like sunburns or when you're cooking in the kitchen and you have burns, this is the perfect way to um, heal your skin back and to get rid of that um, scar that you get. Instead of like when you have sunburns using um, some products that are not natural, this is the naturals the most naturals of natural way that you can get your skin back to health and it is a natural product So usually I'll do this um, now that I found where they sell it. I'll do this usually once a week and it is also really, really good for kids hair. Like my kids, when they go to school, they come back and their hair is always full of sand and like dirt and everything. And this, when you put it in the hair and you wash it, it really, really cleans the scalp as well. So if you have little kids who like always bring stuff home it is really good and it will also stop them from getting um lies as well in their hair like bugs and all those stuff because you know aloe vera is like the taste of it is really really sour so it would also keep um insects away from uh, their hair and this is so funny to me and my daughter will always come back and I'll be like, oh, you have sand in your hair. And she'll be like, yeah, but if I don't put it in my hair. And I'm like, 
when she was putting it in your hair didn't you see it or where were you were you like did you have like an uh, out of body experience that you were not present when she was putting it in your hair but you know kids knowing my daughter she did it herself and she's like if I did it if I did it <laughs> So this part is done. Let me get a clip to put it away. Like this clip is just here, but I'm always looking for it. I don't know why.
so guys this is it we're all done as you can see um i didn't use my cap as i usually do and uh, the reason for it is if i use the cap the hair tend to be really really um rough and tacky so i will just leave it like this if you like you can add heat to it as well but i prefer using it um like this letting it do its natural thing that it does so basically this is it i'll do this like um once a week i'll switch it up with other things so doing this will really really help like you see now i'm itching right now that is because it is working it gets rid of itchiness as well so if you're somebody who has an itchy scalp this is the product for you so thank you guys so much for sticking around and watching me do my thing and as always see you guys in my next video deuces bye guys